What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 welcome newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, uh, Scorpio, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This free general collective reading for Sign of Scorpio. This can resonate against sports in any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Earth, and Moon, Hammer, Jupiter, chart. Stuff is basic. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with us. Free general pleasure reading for Sign Scorpio. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys so much. I really do, do, do. Thanks for all the shares of my content. Thanks for all the love and support to my channel. You guys are the best. All right, so I received two channel messages as I was meditating on your energy, Scorpio. The first one I heard, um, a family reunion of the past is going to become very significant for one of you. That was the first one. And I heard for one of you guys, a feminine energy co-worker of your past is about to become very significant. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. Now, I feel this can go positive or negative. You know, significance can be in a positive or negative way. So you plug it in how it resonates, Scorpio. Okay. Now, as always, free general collective reading. So it's very important. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Okay. Um, but for one of you guys, a family reunion of the past is about to become significant. So of the past. Now, this could be your family, family reunion, or somebody else's family. You went to a family reunion with. How that resonates and applies. But some kind of family reunion energy, whether it's your family or or you went with somebody's family to a family reunion um, of the past, is about to become significant for one of you guys and for one, a femme energy co-worker of your past. So you don't work with her anymore, but you used to. And she's about to become significant in your life, either in a positive or negative way. So for some, it could be an earth sign or a fire sign co-worker, ex-co-worker, or... Somehow, maybe an earth sign or a fire sign at this family reunion of the past is about to become significant, possibly. Um, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Aries, Leo, Sag. They can have a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Aries, Leo, Sag in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, north, them, and Hamish, Jupiter charts. If this resonates and applies for you, Scorpio. Okay, Scorpio. Fair woman, dealings or relationship with a woman with blonde, gray, or white hair, target, a goal-oriented person, broken wishbone, a wish will not be granted. All right, let's see. Messages you have a uh, side scorpio. Power number 11 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 11, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number. Power, I feel for some, your position's a high authority, or you can be a position of authority in your own life, maybe your business owner, or your position of authority out in the 3D. How that resonates and applies. An earth sign is about to shock you, completely shock you. For one, they're about to have a new look. For one, they're about to quit speaking to you. Okay, an earth sign is about to completely shock you. For one of these earth signs, they're about to take on a different look. So some kind of external, aesthetically different look. For one, they're going to quit talking to you. So earth sign energy, however this resonates and applies, um, Scorpio, whether it's mass or him, earth sign. For one of you guys, an earth sign's going to quit talking to you. For one, they're going to um, change up their look in some shape, form, or fashion. So, wish will not be granted. I think for some, you you probably want them to talk to you. 
Maybe this is like dating or something like that. For one, it's a sneaky link. For one, it's a sneaky link. So for one, it's a sneaky link. So for one of these earth signs, they're a sneaky link. They're just going to quit talking to you. Um, for one, they're a family member. For one, they're a family member. For one, they're a sneaky link. And for one, they're a family member. The one's going to quit talking to you. And for one, earth sign, they're about to completely change up their aesthetic look. So how that resonates and applies. Dragon. Shocking power play moves by a fire sign is about to shock the hell out of you soon. Leo energy strong. Shocking power play moves made by a fire sign is about to shock the hell out of you by uh, Leo energy strong. So power play move energy coming up, coming, uh, coming by Leo. Uh, Mask or if you have Leo, they can have Leo in any aspects of their charts, but some kind of shocking power play moves. About to come up um, by Leo, Master of Leo. Heard it's going to shock you. So, um, this is your Leo energy, their fire sign. So, um, shocking power play moves, man. I think they're going to be strategic. You plug it in, how it resonates. And that could be the power too. Power play moves by this Leo. For some, it's shocking power play moves by you. For one, it's shocking power play moves by you. And a Pisces really does not want you to make these power play moves, but you're about to. Okay, for one of you guys, it's shocking power play moves. And a Sagittarius and a Libra. A Pisces, a Sagittarius, and a Libra doesn't want you to make some kind of power play move, shocking power play move, but I, I heard you're about to. So some kind of shocking power. Okay, so for one of you guys, one Scorpio, there's some kind of shocking power play moves upcoming, coming by a Leo energy. Mass Scorpio and Leo. They can have Leo in any aspects of their charts, but it's going to shock you. So it's your fire sign, Leo. Um, for another one of you guys, um, you are about to make shocking power play moves. I heard a Sag, a Libra, and a um, Pisces doesn't want you to make them, but you're about to. So whether it's power play moves made by the, this Leo, that's going to shock you or are you about to make the power play move and the Sag, the um, Libra or the, uh, who is it? Sag, Libra and, um, I forgot, man. Sag, Libra and um, Pisces doesn't want you to make, okay? Power play moves. Let me go turn the light on real quick, you guys. I'll be right back. I can't. Apologize about that. Fair woman dealing with a relationship with a woman with blonde, gray, or white hair. A Scorpio was seriously taken advantage of in the past. Seriously taken advantage of. And for one, someone is trying to steal from you. Bank account. You need to be careful of your information. Sexual abuse of the past. Okay, so for one, you were seriously taken advantage of sexual abuse in the past. Um, for one of you. So for one of you guys, it was sexual, sexual abuse of the past. Um, I'm sorry for whoever that's for. Nobody should be financially abused, mentally abused sexually abused or any kind of abuse nobody should be abused um, verbally abused but 
You were sexually abused in the past. Um, about to speak up on it. About to speak up on it. So the one that was sexually abused, you're about to speak up on it. And it's about to benefit you in a huge way. For one, your child was sexually abused. You have found this out and you're about to speak up on it. For one, you know of another child that was sexually abused and you're about to deliver information on it. Okay, so there's three of you. Okay, so for one, you were sexually abused. You're about to speak up on it. For one, your child was sexually abused. You're about to speak up on it. You know information on it. For one, you know information on another child that was sexually abused. And it sounds like you're about to deliver the information of the other child that was sexually abused to the parent. Hopefully a parent that cares, not one that participates in child grooming. Just saying, just saying. Um, how that resonates applies. So whether you were sexually abused and about to speak up on it, your child was sexually abused and you know the information and you're about to speak up on it, or another child was sexually abused, you're about to contact hopefully a parent that cares or a guardian that cares or somebody that actually cares and they don't participate in incest and child grooming and pedophilia. Um, and they uh, are going to take some action. How that resonates applies. Feel for some of you Scorpios, you could have blonde, gray, or white hair, or your child could have blonde, gray, or white hair, or the child, other child that was sexually abused could have blonde, gray, or white hair. How that resonates in a class. Target, a goal-oriented person. For one, you're an FBI agent and you're very good at your job and you are about to start moving on a case very soon. For one, you're an FBI agent and um, you're very good at your job and you're about to start moving on a case very soon. So FBI agent, position of high authority, light side, light side, and you're very good at your job and you're light side. Your position of authority in the FBI, Federal Bureau of Investigation. You might be a femme or masculine takes on heavy femme and you might have blonde, gray, or white hair, ma'am, or sir, with ma'am energy, FBI agent possibly, but you're light side and you're about to start moving on a case very soon, whoever you are. I didn't hear if you're masculine or feminine, but I feel you might have blonde, gray, or white hair. Target, a goal-oriented person, but you're very goal-oriented. I heard you're very good at your job, um, FBI agent. A fire sign about to call into the FBI is about to deliver more information on this situation. It was a huge situation in the past and they covered it up. Okay, I heard a fire sign that's about to call into the FBI soon and deliver information on this situation, this case in the past. I heard it was a huge situation in the past, but somebody covered it up. It sounds like people in the FBI covered it up. Um, I heard it was huge, but. Um, Somebody strategically covered it up. I feel low vibrational energies in the FBI covered it up. Um, but I heard it's about to help this case in a huge way. So the case you FBI agent, I feel, is about to start moving on. So here's your fire sign about to call into the FBI. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They could have Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or North, Node, and Hammond, Jupiter charts. How this resonates and applies. Scorpio. They have some big information or evidence or something. They're about to um, call into the FBI. So call into your department there, sir or ma'am. I think they have lots of passion, desire, and drive and motiv motivation to call into the FBI. They really want to help this situation out. They know it was covered up in the past. They really want to sit, help the situation out. They know it was covered up in the past. So you, FBI agent, I think you're. I think you're going to be working on this case. That's exactly what I think. I heard it was huge in the past, but people strategically covered it up. Um, but it sounds like you're about to blow up the cover-up, sir, ma'am. You're about to blow up the freaking cover-up. And you're going to get huge high honor for this. It is huge. 
Okay, I heard him. You're going to get huge high honor for this. It is huge. So you taking on this case or working on this case or uncovering or unraveling this case, how this resonates and applies. This is the cover up energy of the past of this case, I feel. But you are about to take this on. I'm assuming with other people, but um, only you know your situation is story, not anybody else. But I heard basically it was huge. It was huge or it is huge, but it was so huge they covered it up. But this fire sign is about to be very integral. That's about to call into the FBI with some kind of um, information or evidence or something. They know huge information on this. Huge. Names, locations, websites. They, they know huge information on this. Names, locations, and websites. And evidence and evidence names locations websites and evidence um this fire sign is very integral for you fbi agent um i think it's going to help you hit your goal of information with the names the websites and um uh, what was it names websites and uh, something else and um uh, um whatever information they provide some kind of evidence For one, you're about to purchase a home gym. For one, you're about to sell a home gym. So for one, you're about to purchase a home gym. And for one, you're about to sell a home gym. So goal is to buy, purchase a home gym or sell a home gym. I love home gyms. And that's just the truth. Broken wishbone and wish will not be granted. A Virgo and a Gemini is about to ever regret sabotaging. You, for one, for one, a fire sign feminine of the past. A Virgo and a Gemini, masculine fem Virgo or masculine fem Gemini. They could have Virgo or Gemini and they're seminarizing Venus or feminine hand Jupiter charts. For one of you guys, they sabotaged you, the Virgo or Gemini. They're going to ever regret it. For one of you guys, they sabotage the fire sign them in your past. They're about to ever regret it. So whoever the Virgo or Gemini are, they could have Virgo or Gemini in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Feb, and hey, your charts. But sabotage energy of the past, whether it was you was sabotaged by Virgo or Gemini, or a, a fire sign them in your past, Aries, Leo, Sag, your past, that was sabotaged by a Virgo or Gemini. They're about to ever regret it. Broken wishbone, a wish will not be granted. Fence company is about to become very significant in a Scorpio's life. And a roofing company. Insurance. Okay, I heard a fit. Ooh. A fence company and a roofing company is about to become very significant in a, a Scorpio's life insurance. So I wonder if you're going to, if you have insurance to cover um the roof is what i'm thinking for one or the fence um some kind of insurance company is involved so i'm thinking it might be for the roof is what i'm thinking um home warranties can cover like fences depending on what kind of home warranty you purchase but i heard an insurance company was involved so i think it's probably the roof but for some it could be the fence but somehow a fencing company a roofing company and an insurance company is about to come very significant in your life i think for one you're going to use um your insurance company to cover a new roof either on your home or somebody else's home for some it could be defense but like i said home warranties usually cover things like that depending on which plan you pick goal of getting the roof or the fence fixed whether it's yours or somebody you're connected to broken wishbone a wish will not be granted A Libra is about to try to come back into your life. This would not be smart.
For one, there's no way, no way. For one, you will think about it. For one, it's a masculine Libra. One, it's a fem Libra. Okay, so for one of you guys, it's a masculine Libra. For one, it's a fem Libra. You have to plug them in, how they resonate. But I heard uh, they're going to try to attempt to come back into your life. So they're not in your current energetic space right now, I'm feeling. I uh, feel for some of you block them or energetically block them out of your life or what have you, what have you. But they're not in your life right now. Um, they're going to try to come back, whether it's a masculine Libra or a fem Libra. Um, I heard for one, you're definitely not going to allow them back. So wish will not be granted. You will not allow them access back into your life for one. For one, I heard you will think about it. Um, so now you think about it, whether you do it or don't, that's on you. You have the power here. You have the power. Okay. So not allowing that one access into your life, whether it's masculine or femme or masculine and femme, or the power to not allow them in your life, whether you think about it and allow them in or not. How that resonates and applies to Scorpio. Power. A Scorpio is about to start really honing their personal power thoughts their own thoughts their own personal power not listening to other people as much a scorpio is about to start honing their own thoughts their own power not listening to other people as much um so independent Thinking is what I'm feeling here, Scorpio, if this resonates for you. Independent thinking, independent creativity, not energy harvesting or energy sharing or energy sucking off anybody or having them do it to you. Um, your own thoughts, your own creativity, your own mind. I heard you not listening to other people as much. So I think in the past, if this resonates for you, um, this is power of independent thought here. Independent decisions um, is what I'm feeling. I feel whoever this is for, you didn't, I think you might have listened to, took other people's advice too much in the past. Like, very codependent energy, like you listen, you depended too much on what other, other people's advice. You didn't take the advice and stop and think about it, you just took it and went, because that's what they said to do. I think you're going to stop and not be so impulsive and... Think about what's best for you. Take, listen to the advice, but power of your own mind. If you want to make the decision, you make the decision, kind of thing, is what I feel. Power of your own mind, your own thoughts, your own control, power, personal power. For one, you're about to be asked, Mary, an underage female. This would not be smart. You know the mother will not approve of this. It will cause legal issues. Someone needs to hear this. You're a Scorpio masculine. Oh, Lord. Okay, so for one, you're a Scorpio masculine. I heard you're about to be asked to marry an underage female, so a minor female. Um, but I heard this would not be smart because the mother of the underage female, I heard she is not going to approve of this. She's not going to agree of it. And she has joint legal rights. Know this. And she has joint legal rights. So she has joint legal rights and custody of this child, it sounds like, because this child is still a minor. Um, I heard the mother will not approve of it. So you really need to hear this. Um, now, whether you really want to marry her or not, I don't know. It sounds like it's peer pressure here. but doesn't sound like it's smart. Um, let the female go grow up and be her own self. The female needs to hear that. She doesn't need to get married as a freaking minor. That's not that's not healthy. We don't we live in 2022, not 18, 2022. I mean 18, 22 or 16, 22. Female needs to hear that. No, equal rights. Women's rights. The female needs to hear that. That's weird. It's a female teenager. It's a female teenager. Let her live life by her damn self. She don't need no husband. I 
I didn't hear anything else, but I heard uh, it will cause legal issues. So I heard the mom will not agree, and she has joint um, legal custody of this minor female. If you were the one, masculine Scorpio, about to be asked to marry um, the female. It sounds like the father's going to ask you to marry her or a stepmother or so another family member or something. Not the mother. Wouldn't be smart there. Just saying, just saying. An Aquarius is about to try to come back into your life. They bullied you severely in the past. This would not be smart. And sexual abuse here. Okay, I heard an Aquarius is about to try to come back into your life, Scorpio. Um, I heard they bullied you severely in the past and there was some kind of sexual abuse. So I think this sex, uh, Aquarius sexually abused you is what I think, um, whoever this resonates with. Um, if this resonates, um, gigolo energy of the past, you were their gigolo. Oh, gigolo energy of the past, you were their gigolo. So they paid you for sexual services, you were their gigolo, but they're going to try to come back to you. Um, it's an Aquarius of your past. You're masculine, if this resonates for you. You're masculine, sorry, gigolo. You're masculine, Scorpio. But the Aquarius, whether they're masculine or femme, they paid you for sex in the past, but they're going to try to come back. Now, if they're going to try to come back for sex, I don't know. But they're going to try to come back for some reason. And I heard they sexually abused you, meaning they knew that you needed the money. So they, and they knew they wanted sex from you. I think you look, look good is what I think. I think you look good and you're aesthetically pleasing or you at least look good to them. And that's why that they knew they had power over you because you needed the money. And so, they gave you money for sex. Now, I didn't hear they were going to try to come back for sex this time, but they are going to try to come back, but I heard it wouldn't be smart because they sexually abused you, meaning held money over your head for sex services. I heard it wouldn't be smart, so wish will not be granted. I think for some, you're not going to allow them back. For some, you may. You have your free will and choice. How that resonates in a class. But you are masculine if that resonates for you because I heard gigolo. For one, you're about to send a shocking text message to a Sagittarius soon. Shocking. They're not going to want to hear it. But you know you should do this, and you're going to. Okay. For one, you're going to send a shocking text message to a Sagittarius. So it could be masculine, him, Sag. They can have Sag in any aspects of their cards, but um, some kind of Sag energy. I heard, um, you know, um, they're not going to want to hear it. So whatever it is, whatever kind of relationship with this Sag you have. Um, it could be business. It could be personal. It could be sneaky link. It could be family. It could be community. But I heard you know they're not going to want to hear it. But I heard you know you should send it, and I heard you're going to. So personal power over your thoughts and what you're about to send this Sagittarius. I think it's going to um, have them a wish not granted. They are not going to be happy, but they know there's going to be nothing they can do about it. Okay, I heard they're not going to be happy, but they know there's going to be nothing they can do about it. So their wish will not be granted. They're not going to be happy over whatever this text is you're about to send them, Scorpio. Um, but I heard they're not going to be happy, but there's going to be nothing they can do about it. So power over your own thoughts, power over what you're about to send. How that resonates and applies, okay? For one, you're about to be very, very honest with the feminine energy co-worker of your past. You never thought you would, but the cycles have changed and you're about to make a power play move. You used to work with her in the past. 
Okay, for one, you're about to be very, very, very honest with a femme energy co-worker of your past. I heard you're about to be very honest with her. You never thought you would be, but you're about to be um, because cycles have changed. So some kind of cycles have changed. Um, how that resonates and applies. It's a femme energy of your co-worker of your past. For some, I feel it could be an earth sign or a fire sign. Only you know who you're about to be honest with, not anybody else, Scorpio. But um, they could have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Aries, Leo, Sag, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Femme, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. But... You're about to be very honest with them um, over something, I think, uh, over something, whatever it is. Whatever it is, um, it could make them upset, possibly, which will not be granted, or maybe, it, it can, I feel it might make them upset or it might make them happy. I feel it can go either way, positive or negative, okay? Um, how that resonates and applies. But um, power over the situation, I heard you never thought you would be honest with them, but you're about to be. Um, so, of course, this is your personal power, you being honest, your free will choice to do this. For some, the femme energy of your past, I feel, could have blonde, gray, or white hair, possibly. Um, possibly. But you plug it in how it resonates, Scorpio. Only you know who you're about to be honest with of your past, not anybody else. It's a former femme co-worker. For one, you're about to shockingly get invited to a Thanksgiving dinner. But there will be a lot of drama there. A lot. Know this. It really would not be smart. Okay, for one, you're about to get invited to a Thanksgiving dinner. Um, shockingly get invited to a Thanksgiving dinner, but I heard there's gonna be a lot of drama there, a lot. I heard it wouldn't be smart. So, for one, you're about to get a Thanksgiving invitation. Um, you know, I think Thanksgiving's in like a week or something. Um, but you're about to shockingly get a Thanksgiving invitation soon. Um, but I heard there's gonna be a lot of drama there. So, it sounds like there's gonna be a, I don't know, man. <laughs> it's just me and my roommate. So, I, I, I don't know. I don't associate with, um, my family and I haven't for years so um and I'm not going anywhere for Thanksgiving so I don't know but one of you guys you're about to get invited for Thanksgiving uh somewhere and but I heard it was gonna be a lot of drama so of course you have free will to go but how that resonates applies it don't sound like you've been invited yet love you guys so much everybody have a wonderful day and namaste